Uh, one thing you're going to do is set your levels to make sure that it's uh, loud enough. Now, there's no way to change uh, the input um, coming before your audio interface. It has to be done from the device itself or from the guitar amp or, you know, or your preamp or whatever. That's how you adjust the input coming in. Once, once everything is in reason, you have a lot more flexibility in terms of raising the gain or, or changing the levels. But it's really important to get a nice solid level uh, when recording. So what I like to do is use the floating uh, recording meter. Uh, you hit F3, and this, this will bring up this uh, recording meter. You also notice here that there is a tuner built into it as well. That's great for guitarists or if you have an analog synth that needs uh, to be tuned a little bit. So you make sure you're, you're in the right key. Um, so if I hit a key on my little synth here, So I'm coming in at about minus 16 dB, which is more than adequate. Usually minus 16, minus 12, that's, that's a really good level if you're working at 24 bits. I highly recommend working at 24 bits over 16 bit. Um, I talk a lot about this in the book, but in, in essence, uh, 24 bits has a much lower signal to noise ratio, meaning you don't have to record as high. In fact, I could record at minus 25, um, my level set at minus 25 and then raise up the gain to zero dB.